If you're one of the 45 million Americans this year that plan on going on a diet, I have one word of advice for you, don't. The reason for this is that 99% of all diets fail because they fail to address the root cause of weight gain in the first place, often only addressing the symptoms of calories in, calories out, portion control, calorie restrictions, and exercise as a means to lose weight. These antiquated dieting techniques actually do the opposite and promote weight gain, not weight loss. They slow your metabolism, stimulate fat storing, increase hunger, and turn on cravings. Even worse, the average person that attempts a new diet or weight loss program, they'll actually gain eight to 10 pounds for every failed diet attempt. You see, to lose weight in today's world is like trying to roll a rock up a hill. If you're successful at losing weight, odds are, unless you address the root cause of weight gain, you'll most likely gain it all back over time, have to start over, lose muscle mass along the way, slow metabolism, and make it much more difficult for future dieting attempts. This is why I am releasing my newest book, due out in March of 2018, called Toxic Free Diet where I expose the five critical mistakes that diet plans do not address and teach you the simple steps on how to turn weight loss resistance into weight loss results 100% of the time. Hi, my name is James Uberti, health and wellness author, environmental toxin expert, founder and director of Desert Cryotherapy Pain Relief and Weight Loss Center, and president of Toxic Free Market. Over the course of 42 months of researching why we get fat in the first place and why most diets fail, I uncover the following five diet mistakes that diets make. Diets fail today because they fail to address the critical role that chemicals play on fat storage. According to modest estimates, we are exposed to over 700,000 toxic chemicals every single day. In fact, the average female before they even leave their bathroom is exposed to and wears up to 500 different types of toxic chemicals, from her shampoos to hair care, to eye makeup liner, to foundation, all these toxic chemicals get absorbed into our skin and end up in our bodies. Now our bodies are organic mechanisms and essentially they do not know how to detoxify synthetic man-made chemicals. And so the best option, instead of keeping it around in your blood or in your organs, they absorb it into your fat cell. And I want you to think of a fat cell as a water balloon. They expand and contract based on the amount of foods that we eat, the type of foods that we eat, and the type of chemicals that we expose these fat cells to. So what makes matters worse is these fat cells expand rapidly because once they absorb these toxic chemicals, they have to dilute the toxicity, rapidly advancing the size of those fat cells. You see, unless you address fat fertilizing foods and fat fertilizing chemicals, you'll never seem to lose weight. In my book, Toxic Free Diet, I uncover and I teach you how to reduce and remove and avoid fat fertilizing chemicals. If you are frustrated and sick and tired of failed weight loss attempts over and over again and want to turn weight loss resistance into weight loss results without actually restricting calories or exercising until your legs fall off, simply add your name and email address to be alerted when my book is available for sale. As a special bonus, while waiting for the release of my book, I'll send you a detailed list of the five most critical mistakes that diet make to help you start your journey on losing weight and feeling great. I'm excited to release my newest book and I know that you're gonna love it. In fact, you're gonna love the results, you're gonna love looking great and feeling great, and you're gonna love losing weight the easy way. My name is James Uberti. Live young, be well.